trail mix is a tasty treat, and making it at home is super easy. The first mix we're making is called Netflix and Chill. Here's what you'll need. Popcorn, M&Ms, peanuts, dried cranberries, and cherries. The first thing you want to do is pop some popcorn. Mix in your fruit, nuts, and chocolate. Put it in a popcorn box, and you have the perfect binge-worthy snack. And if the popcorn's hot enough, you get melted chocolate. Up next, the Raging Cajun. For this one, you'll need canola oil, almonds, pecans, walnuts, sunflower seeds, pumpkin seeds, and add spices like salt, garlic powder, chili powder, ground cumin, and cayenne pepper. First, you want to start by preheating your oven to 350 degrees. Combine a half a cup each of almonds, pecans, and walnuts. Toss in a half a cup of shelled sunflower seeds and pumpkin seeds. And finally, a teaspoon of each salt, garlic powder, chili powder, cayenne pepper, and cumin. Swipe some canola oil around the bowl a few times and toss it together. Take out a baking sheet, spread them out thin. Then pop them in the oven for 15 minutes until they're toasted. After it's done, pour it out and brace yourself. Perfect, it's still warm. Pumpkin seeds are popping. And finally, PB&J time. For this one, you'll need peanut butter and chocolate chips, dried banana chips, peanuts, and almonds. But here's where the twist is. Instead of grape jelly, we're going to be using raisins. Mix it all up and enjoy. Chocolate goes great with the banana chips, the almonds, and of course the raisins. Happy trails on Corsetti Cooks.